Hello, it's me again, Asher here. I gave it some time and I know that this video that I posted previously about Zines got spoken about in some capacity on Twitter, so I do consider that a mission accomplished on my part. Yes, I knew full well that it would likely get eviscerated for daring to have an opinion that didn't toe the line, but I never gave a rat's ass about that. The point of the video was to point out a trend in the Zion community, specifically the Final Fantasy XV community. I do have a right to speak about issues that I see. One thing that I noticed about several responses that I got was just the deflection that what I am seeing is not real and it's all in my head. I don't think that's the case, which is the whole point in making the video. I won't be gaslit into believing that something that other people have told me in private, too, is not happening. I'm sure people will feel exonerated that someone finally said something about the issues that I've stated in the video. I realize with the Final Fantasy XV community, a lot of people are, for whatever reason, afraid to speak out for fear of the same thing happening to them for their beliefs. If you do fall into this category, I do sincerely hope that you are not miserable because of a few bad actors. No one is giving power without your express consent. And if you do believe that someone is that powerful, it's all in your head and theirs. I'll state again, I'm not wired that way and I simply do not have the time or the patience to deal with this type of bullshit in my life. I left high school decades ago and I'm not going to be drawn back into it. Yes, I'm fully aware that it ruined my chances of being involved in any Final Fantasy XV community projects and that's fine. I stood up for my convictions and I have been feeling much better now that I was able to vent. Those that criticized me, you're welcome to have those opinions. No matter how much you turn black and blue in the face telling me that I'm wrong, the video is staying up. I do believe that everything I said holds weight to it although opinions would differ on how much of what I said applies. No, I'm not deleting the comments. They aren't going anywhere since they are part of the engagement on YouTube. Even a dislike is a win because that tells me that you were taking that one second to tell me your feelings regardless if I agree with them or not. I will say to my detractors that calling me out my name isn't really addressing the issues that I've seen. You're welcome to do that too. I will respond to all feedback, but it becomes obvious when someone is just hearing what I said and not listening, and yeah, there's a difference. Lemon Tea, you are actually the worst when it came to that. I would appreciate you not putting words in my mouth or giving me positions that I never had. What is interesting about your entire comment is both you said that the click issues that I'm talking about don't happen, and in the same breath, defend the mod's ability to do it. The entirety of your comment was catty at best, and it looks as though you already had an expectation going in. The fact that you stopped at 37 minutes in and didn't even bother to listen to what I had to say further only makes me believe your objective was to slander and twist my words. People can listen to the video and make their own judgments. That is, again, why I made it this way. I will say that your comment were missing a lot of context, but I don't expect a genuine response out of you, in all honesty. And as far as Lumen1500 goes, the reason I didn't give you another response is because I feel like we are going around in circles. I'll state again, Arden is a niche character to write about in this fandom. He barely has 5k fix that have his name even featured on stories. You act like I'm being unreasonable when I am pointing out that there were writers that do actively write about Arden and they got rejected. And considering at least one of these writers isn't even in the Final Fantasy XV community actively, I reject the idea that this was strictly my portfolio wasn't good enough. I don't even think they looked at it. That type of shit doesn't happen with 25% of your writers barely speaking about Arden unless there is bias going around, which is my biggest issue in this matter. As far as my reputation and the mods reputation, that's a two-way street. I've stated that I don't hate the mods. Trust me, I could have been a lot more of a dick if I wanted to, but that wasn't the point in this. If you're picking your friends when you list a public project, I'm going to call that shit out for what it is. And the truth is, I don't want anything to do with these people in question. I stand by my words and my convictions. I'd rather be known for being a genuine person that is consistent than act as though this is the everything is fine meme. And make no mistake about it, if I was somehow within this clique and I saw this behavior, 
I would be calling it out 100%. And one last thing, since this did get brought up with the Callum sign, the names of the writer were shown briefly in the video. I had been made aware that I made them uncomfortable despite it being publicly available information. For that, if you are affected by this and if I made you uncomfortable, I will offer an apology for anyone that may be affected by this, but it was to prove a point and nothing more. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say. I'm not going to put out another public video on Twitter. You'll just have to stumble on it when you view this channel, but I wanted to say my piece. Asher out.